Okay. Well, I'm trying to listen to Zeppelin. Wolfie said she would do the gas pipes for me. And look what she did. She got stoned and fell asleep. Oh, my God. Wolfie, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're just a pain in the ass. You don't do anything around here at all. You get stoned and fall asleep. <laughs> yes, you do. And now you're trying to bite me. Did you ever hear, don't bite the hand that feeds you? Huh? Because the, this hand can kick your ass all over. Yeah. Yeah, it can. You're a pain in the ass. You pooped in the living room. Yes. You pooped four times in the living room on the carpet after I cleaned it. At least it was my living room, not the apartment's. Hey, now I have to clean the carpet again. You're paying for it. You're paying for it. I'm not paying to have the carpets clean. It's your fault. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. Sassy. You are such a problem. You're such a problem. You're always doing something wrong. Every second you're doing something wrong. And then you don't even care. I yell at you, you dive under the bed, and then you realize I'm not going to do anything. Ugh. Can you speak? Can you speak? Huh? You're just a pain in the ass. Don't ever get a German Shepherd. Oh my God. They're ridiculous. Look at this drama. <laughs> You said you were going to cut the lawn. You said you were going to fix the pipes. You were going to help build the wall. And all you did is poop on the carpet. And cause a fight. And you just almost fell head first off the bed. You've got to be stoned. You've got to be stoned. Yeah. <laughs> Sit. Sit. Speak. Speak. Good doggy! Wow! What a good dog! I better find her something. Oh my god, stay! You're a good dog. Look at this mess! Oh my god! Here's my amplifier for my YouTube. So the whole block can hear it. Do you want this really? Do you really want a biscuit? These are Train Me Training Reward. 500 of them. That's 500 woofs. They smell like chocolate. I'm sure they're not. They better not be. Ow, don't bite me. Do you want this? Are you sure? I don't think you like it. You're so fussy. Well, it smells pretty strong. I don't know what it's... I'm not sure what it smells like. But do you want it, really? Are you a good dog? Sit. Where's your paw? Sit. Sit. Paw. Give me your paw. Give me your paw. Give me your paw. Give me your paw. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here you go. And you get another one for speaking. Because you spoke. Can I get you to speak again? You tricked me into letting you out. Yeah. Can I speak once more? Woof. Okay. <laughs> That's a good one. I love my dog. I love my dog. Even after she poops on a rug. You must be something special. Yeah, you are. You're my favorite German Shepherd ever. Yes. Someday I'll get the pictures of my German Shepherds, all of them. From the one my grandma had, and my cousins might remember, her name was Happy. She was born October 12th, 1963. Same day as me, but a year before. She was my little companion dog. Wolfie's trying to steal treats out of my hand. <laughs> You're trying to steal treats out of my hand. You're going to fall off the edge. That would be really funny. <laughs> no, she knows. Uh-oh, uh-oh. She's got the toy. So what am I up doing at 10 o'clock on a Sunday night? I'm getting ready to move this fuse box. It's just temporary. It's gonna go.
right here inside the lines. I'm gonna cut a hole and it's gonna mount it flush. Built this wall around my new furnace. This is the pantry. And there's gonna be a wall right across here. You can see on the floor of that line. It's gonna be a wall separates my bedroom from the pantry. I don't know why. Well, probably to keep me from getting fatter. Here's a furnace on this side. So this wall was all screwed up. So it the whole wall moved. There was a fire. I don't know if you can see the black, but there was a fire sometime. You can see it right up here too. See? Looks like charcoal. Wow, that's the best I, I've seen it so far. But so I framed in these walls really good. And I hooked a window to them, and there's no way this is budging. And this is not what you think. This is spray foam. Keeps the cold air out. Put it around everything because it was, it was, there was no insulation in these walls. I insulated all the way down to the ground, to the second floor, and uh, put the vapor barrier insulation in. I got to tack it down and drywall. Add some plugs. Move the fuse box. Ah, should be done in a couple hours, maybe a couple days. So I'm framing out the wall right down there. You see it. So and I'm using all used pieces that I tore out when I, and that's actually stronger than the new wood. <laughs> Here's the used pieces, and this is going to be a pantry with shelves. So I've got these going this way instead of up and down. And I'm going to reinforce these also. Um, that way I can screw into them. I'm going to have to add some flat, bigger ones here. That way I can screw into them and uh, support the shelves in the pantry because I like stopping up on tomatoes and stuff and spaghetti sauce. And that stuff gets heavy. All right. Down there is the cold return for the furnace. It's got a little metal house that goes around to the side. All right, I'm tired of standing up. I gotta rest. I'm gonna get up and work for a few more hours. Night, guys.